How's it going, everybody? Ian back with another video tonight. Uh, just a quick update on what I've been reading. Uh, so, uh, I don't have some of these physical books. I did read Crossed, Volume 2, uh, by uh, David Lapham. Uh, Garth has created that world. Gave it three stars. And then, um, I don't know if I'll be continuing with that series. And then I also read um, uh, The uh, um, Empire of Skulls. Uh, which is by Andy McDermott. It's a 16th in the Nina Wild Lady Chase series. Gave it three stars, and I enjoy it. It's, I think it's become like a Netflix thing. I don't have those physically. I have them on my Kindle. Um, and then for the crossed one, I had to give back to the library. So physical books I've read. I read The Witchwood Crown by Tad Williams. Uh, the last book one of the last King of Austin Art trilogy, or I think it's going to be a, a four-book series. Uh, enjoyable. Uh, I would definitely recommend reading the Dragon Bone Chair, uh, or it's called uh, Memory, Sorrow, and Thorn uh, series by him before you pick this up. Uh, and then I also read uh, Rotten Ruin by uh, Jonathan Mayberry. Uh, this is the, I've already read this before. I listened to this actually, and I read part of it as well. Uh, just to get in the Halloween mood, I guess. Um, because we're coming in, into that thing. It's a young adult zombie. Uh, it's a four book series. Really, well, I really enjoyed them, and I still, on the upon the reread, I really enjoyed it as well again. Uh, and then I also read *The Vulnerable Gods* by Todd the Librarian, otherwise known as Todd Wittenmeyer. Uh, gave this one three stars. It's a pretty good romp. Uh, it, I, you know, don't want to talk too much about it. Uh, uh, it, for like spoilers, but yeah, we got time travel and um, like a monster mystery, I guess, if you will, maybe, maybe along that line. But I won't say too much. I, I definitely recommend it. Um, yeah, it was a really good, fun, small town, uh, I guess, horror ish, I guess. Uh, and yeah, really enjoyed it. Thank you. Uh, and then, what am I currently reading? Currently reading. Tanya Huff, uh, Valor's Choice, uh, book one in, I think this is an eight-part series. Not 100% sure what that's about yet. Not really into that yet. Uh, and then, I've read 50 pages of this today. Stephen King's Fairy Tale, and really enjoying so far uh, what's going on. So, um, yeah, that's what I've got. And then I picked out, we're going to keep these videos short. My, my computer went to shit. So I might need to get a new one. I don't know when I don't have the funds to do that. So I might be filming sporadically maybe on my phone to see if I can figure that or a tablet. Um, but uh, right now it's not charging or it's not charging the battery. So I have to have it plugged in. So I don't know how long that's going to last. I don't, I don't know a thing about computers. So hopefully it'll keep running as long as I have it uh, plugged in. I guess it's just a, it's not really a laptop anymore. It's an old school desktop, I guess. Picked up Wolves by DJ Moles. Uh, DJ Moles wrote The Remaining, which is that awesome zombie stuff, zombie uh, zombie series. And then I picked up the second the in this uh, duology, The Warrior by Stephen Arian. So I can't wait to pick uh, read this in the coming weeks. And then I'm also reading the Alexandria Link on my tablet by uh, Steve Barry, uh, and that's the second in the Cotton Malone series. That's all I got. Keep these short. Hopefully my computer doesn't shit, shit itself. Goodbye.